Hey, this is Kaylin, and I'm trying to use my Apple Pencil on this iPad, and it's not working. So what do I do? Well, there's actually a really simple fix. So I'm going to share my iPad screen with you, and I'm writing on it, and nothing's happening. So I'm going to go out of here and come into Settings, okay? Now in Settings, under Bluetooth, my Bluetooth is on, and when I do this, it says plug it in to use it with this iPad. So I'm going to do that and show you what happens. All right, I'm going to take the tip off my Apple Pencil. I'm going to stick it in right here and then hit it again. And it gives me the same error. Plug in Apple Pencil to use it with this iPad. But it's, pl it's clearly plugged in and it's giving me the same error. But here's the fix, OK? So let me plug this back in so I can show you how to fix this, because it's actually super simple, OK? On this screen, next to the Apple Pencil, instead of hitting it, I'm going to hit this eye over here in the corner. This blue eye next to not connected. I'm going to come over here and go to forget this device. Yes, forget it. We don't need this device. Hey, wait a minute. What's that device over there? Is that an Apple Pencil? <laughs> Why, yes, it is. Let's see if we can connect now. Waiting for the Apple. Pairing took too long. Make sure it's turned on and in range. This sort of troubleshooting is unfortunately what you've got to do with uh, Bluetooth connections. Do you know where the na the Bluetooth name came from? It came from this, um, this uh, Norse king. He was like a Viking king. Uh, I can't remember his, his name, but his initials are the Bluetooth rune. That it was a rune that he used to sign things. And he was called Bluetooth because he ate blueberries all the time and it stained his teeth blue. And what he was known for was for getting these warring tribes to come together and talk to one another. And previously, like nobody did negotiations and everybody would just settle everything with war. But Bluetooth was known as this warlord who would actually get people together to communicate and talk to one another. And that integral communication between different types of people with different communication styles, that's what Bluetooth was originally meant to do. The Bluetooth protocol was, was meant to say, hey, are you a, uh, a printer? Are you a laptop computer? Are you a handheld PDA? Like whatever you are, we're going to use this same protocol and bring everybody together to talk. Unfortunately, it's not working today because as I'm sure you've seen, having the Bluetooth connection problems, the pairing is something that you have to do again and again, repeating repeatedly. Aha, I've got something. Okay, I've, I've been plugging it in and taking it out and oh, I can't show you because I have to have I have to have this plugged in. So let me show you here. I've got a Bluetooth pairing request. Apple Pencil would like to pair with your iPad. It took me a while all that time. <laughs> look at that green screen. That's fun. Um, it took me a while to get it to go. I had to like plug it in and tell it to do it again. Sometimes you have to do a reboot. But now I'm connected. So I'll show you my screen, what I've got here. The Apple Pencil is connected. So now when I come back over into Notability and I want to write, I'm able to do it. So that is how you fix the Apple pairing pencil, the Apple Pencil pairing problem. This is a great tongue twister. If you have an Apple Pencil pairing problem, forget the device. Go to the Bluetooth settings, hit that little blue eye, and forget about it, and then repair. Ha! That's how you repair it. <laughs> Hope you found this useful. If we're not connected already, go ahead and hit the subscribe button or like this video or leave a comment and let me know if it helped you. Have fun out there.